And if you're looking at something to do on Saturday, you might want to check out a big event going on at the Resh. It involves the Gamblers. And Terry uh, Charles is with me along with, that's, that's Grant right there. That's Beth right there from Sport Clips. And why on the world is Beth shaving the head of Grant. That's the question this morning, Terry. Terry, tell us why. Well, Pete, it's the uh, sixth annual Caps for Cancer Toss presented by North Shore Bank at the Rush Center on Saturday for the Gamblers game. Premise is pretty simple. We're asking fans to bring a new hat or cap to the game. All those hats are given to Heavenly Hats, a local organization who gives them to cancer patients. Great cause. We collected uh, well over 2,000 hats last year. And we have some video of that. Of course, this is great video, too, um, because and now how many gamblers are going to be shaving their heads? Uh, the entire team. The entire team will be shaving their heads uh, at 115 this afternoon in the rest center lobby. Uh, Grant here has been gracious enough to get up early and uh, get a head start. Um, this Caps for uh, Cancer campaign has been going for quite some time, right? Yeah, this is the sixth year. As I mentioned, we had over 2,000 last year, and I think we're probably, I'm guessing, in the four or 5,000 range, if not more, since we uh, started this about six years ago. Now, what if you forget a hat to the game? Can you buy one there? Uh, we may have some hats in the pro shop, uh, but we actually encourage people to bring a new hat. It can be a stocking hat. They especially need hats for women and children. A lot of people think just baseball hats for yeah. guys, which is that's okay, but stocking hats, uh, kids' hats, women hats, anything, it goes to a great cause. Uh, also, uh, for $1, or every ticket sold from $1, um, one dollar from every ticket sold will go to the Vince Lombardi Cancer Clinic as well. So it's really a, a, a total cancer night. That's it. It's a great event. And Grant, uh, it's a little bit chilly out here. Have you been become chillier in the last couple of minutes? Oh, it's a lot colder without the hair. <laughs> that, that was keeping me warm all year. Is this the first time you've had this done? Uh, I did it last year with the team, and uh, hopefully we got a few guys that will go down to the bone with me, but we'll see what happens. Okay, so you were with the team last year, right? I was, yes. Big season last year, wasn't it? Oh, very big. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Uh, Pretty much everything you could ask for. So. Yeah, no doubt about that, especially being down 2-0 in the, in the championship series. Unbelievable. Right? Hopefully we can uh, keep the magic going and yeah. have another good year. I feel confident. So, Very good. And, and Beth, this didn't take you long. Is this one of the easiest haircuts you do? Yes. <laughs> Very easy. <laughs> so uh, will you be um, doing some of the gamblers too then or people from sports clips? Yes. Yep. There will be six girls there. Oh, yeah. great. Great. All right, well, it's Saturday, and uh, you saw the information. Here it is again. Gamblers at Team USA, Saturday at 7.05, fox11online.com for more information, and click on Good Day, Wisconsin. Beth and Grant, thank you very much. Terry, thanks. We'll be right back. You're watching Good Day, Wisconsin.